Northern Rams, all the Muslim, all the blackheads, be a white horn. And uh, there's people up from Clare Island, uh, some of the lads Clare Island and instruct people, they're all island sheep. The, um, the smaller ones then are female, black, black, uh, male black faces. They're uh, two year olds. Do you live on the island? I do. And born on the island? Born and raised here. Yeah. How many sheep are on the island? Well, I'd say in the height of summer with lambs and all, there'd be a couple of thousand here. Uh, then the, the lambs are sold off then in uh, late July, er, early August. And the numbers go back down on the left here, then is the O's and the ram. The ram. So if the cycle starts all again, now it's time to let the rams off the O's and five months later we'll have new lambs. What's so good about the Inishtruck lamb is that it's a uh, very hardy sheep. Um, easy to, easy to uh, feed. Once they go out of here, out to grass on the mainland, they fatten very easily and get, they're ready for finishing and killing quick. So they're hardy and they're easy to finish. That's what's good about them. That's what everybody's trying to get. Fat, cheap, cheap and fat. The idea of the ram fair started with because uh, uh, sometimes you'd find a farmer coming down to the pier and he'd have the ram sold and if people knew about it they'd have it bought here on the island so we decided well if there's rams for sale let you let everyone show what they're selling and uh, there's a lot of swapping done as well as buying so that was the whole idea behind it that people would buy a ram of their neighbour if they knew we were selling it so that's what it started first you know. <laughs> no, it's a, it is a social thing that, um, as Bernard said, there's you know it's a day that everybody gets together and people come to the island for the day and you know all the sh they're they're buying and selling sheep, all these fellas and like here now at the pub there's music and like all the girls come up and that and everybody mixes and there's people from Clare Island here and people from Lewisburg and Westport and around the areas you know and it's a nice way to bring people together too even though I wouldn't know much about the whole sheep side of it, but it's nice to meet the people as well. In, the year, in June we have the shearing competition and the judging, but uh, next year what we plan to do is to leave the judging of the sheep until the ram fair, because most farmers, their lambs and their hoggets would be uh, more mature and uh, it would be fairer to have the judging with the ram fair rather than in June, but uh, the pattern day in June is, is, is one of the big events of the year. So, that's a very good day as well. There's a lot of people about and children and that, so we do a good day at the panel. Yeah, just one ram sold. Market the slow, but they are in the day yet. Will you be buying any? Uh, no, um, I have two for selling. One is already sold, so keeping fingers crossed, I might get rid of the other one for a night. Who bought it? Uh, a neighbour, neighbouring island, Joe Mallow from Clare Island. Uh, when will they be transported over? Uh, hopefully this evening. By boat. By boat, yeah. I'm, well, I'm 11. And my name is Ryan. He knew, and I live kind of in the east part of the shack. What class are you in? Oh, I'm in the fifth class. How many go to your school? Three. Good. Three. Who's your teacher? Uh, Sandra Conn. Conn, she's from Tory. Well, right out in the foggy dew was England. My name is uh, Joe Whelan. Um, originally from County Leash. I've been living here on English Turk for the last one and a half years. Came here for a visit uh, over two years ago, just to come to visit English Turk for a day and uh, met my lovely wife while I was on my visit here and uh, fell in love with her and, and the island and uh, came back then about a year and a half ago. And we got married and uh, I've had a little baby since. Um, up here at the community club today for the, the annual ram fair. I don't know anything about sheep, but just up for the, the crack and the music and there's a bit of banter with sheep buyers and farmers that have come in. And, um, 
love living here in Ingestork. Uh, it's a beautiful place, great people, great community. I work as a deckhand on the O'Malley's Ferries, the ferry that operates between Ingestork and Runa. Really enjoy that as well, even on the even on the rough days. Um, you know, so overall, I think living on an island is probably the best place you could live. You know, it's very peaceful, great. Um, very community spirit, uh, very safe place to live and grow up and raise children. And it's very, uh, very privileged to, to live here. Uh, well, I'm Yeah, it's our annual fair day. Beautiful day as it is, you see the weather. And it's it's absolutely quite a big crowd from Tarrident, mainland. And as you see, there's sheep going. Sheep came and the sheep went. I think there's more going than that came. So thank God for such a great day. And thanks to the Clare Island fellas for coming up.